little bunnies. In a warm, cozy burrow under a big fir tree, a little rabbit held his mummy's hand. Come and say hello to your new baby sister, Pe sisters, Peter, said Mrs. Rabbit. Peter counted. One, two, three, baby bunnies. What are their names, he asked. This is Flopsy, this is Mopsy, and we need to think of a name for this one, says Mrs. Rabbit. Having three baby sisters is going to be a lot of fun, thought Peter. Maybe Flopsy will like my big, noisy drum. Bang, bang, bang. Flopsy did not like Peter's big, noisy drum. So Peter gently rocked his first little sister back to sleep. Perhaps my drum is too noisy, thought Peter. Maybe Mopsy will like my quiet, quiet boat. But Peter's second little sister hardly looked at the boat before yawning and drifting off to sleep. Perhaps my boat is too quiet, thought Peter. Peter felt a tiny bit sad. His little sisters were not as much fun as he thought they might be. Baby bunnies spend a lot of time sleeping, but soon they will want to play with you, said Mrs. Rabbit. Just wait a little while. So Peter Rabbit waited and waited. After what felt like a really long time, Peter heard a tiny sound. His third baby sister was awake. Maybe she's ready to play with me, thought Peter. She was. She giggled and she jiggled and her big fluffy tail wiggled. Peter thought this was so funny that he made her giggle and jiggle and wiggle some more. Soon, Peter's third baby sister was tired and Peter had run out of games to play. We will still need a name for this sleepy bunny, said Mrs. Rabbit. Peter looked at his baby sister's big fluffy wiggly tail. What about Cottontail? He whispered. Cottontail smiled, Mrs. Rabbit. That'll do.